Welcome back to Thief 2 and the mission Precious Cargo. I actually restarted the mission because where I saved was just a few seconds before a guard comes and sees me and it's kind of already impossible to hide. So instead of having to deal with that, I'll just restart it from the beginning. I mean, it was at the beginning anyway and I only spent so much time last time because I wanted to show you a little bit of the beginning um, but now now we're starting for real so the guard comes if from there. I were Cavador, where would I be first no I don't think I have to extinguish that one I I'm safe here yeah um okay let's let's uh, let me knock out that guard real quick and then there's something I actually want to show you the beginning of the level Okay, that's what you get for being in my way and making me restart the damn mission. So, um, I'll shut up for a few seconds because it's super loud here. See, there's a waterfall over there. And yes, I understand that's just so you cannot go that way. Because uh, <coughs> yeah, because it's the beginning of the beginning of the level, and you're not supposed to go that way. I understand it's because of that, but it's still funny to think that Garrett actually rode down a freaking waterfall with a boat like this. Um, but then again, it's Garrett. He's very skilled at many things, so I guess he can do that. Anyway, that's yeah. I don't know. Just found that kind of funny, kind of interesting. Figured I might as well show it to you as well. So, okay, here's a pirate flag, and the first thing that could come to your mind is what is that doing here? Because this is supposed to be an island that the mechanists have taken over, right? But um, the objectives already told us that this was once the place where pirates were hiding, and their Captain Markham also hid his treasure somewhere here. So it kind of makes sense that we still find some leftovers from when this was a pirate's island. Construction Journal. Our work on the underground facility doth proceed as planned. When first we arrived here on Markham's Isle, we found the cove deserted. The lighthouse stood inoperable, and the house of its keeper lay in near ruin. Whatever pirates did to make this place their home oops, uh, departed long before we arrived. The cutthroats did to maintain a hidden base neath the lighthouse, containing several shoddy buildings of poor wood. Remember, the mechanists hate wood. For the most, we destroyed these mockeries of construction, but those that were sound we left standing, to be used for our own purposes. Indeed, on the instruction of Cavador, oh, that's the guy we're looking for, our new facilities have been built directly into those structures that we did to take over. Tis sad indeed to see such powerful steel tainted by the touch of rotting wood. Ugh, wood, e. but need dictates our actions. The new drilling machine is in truth miraculous. Its bit, its bit, uh, from biting I guess, doth bore through solid granite, granite, and the builders, ch I, I know what this is, but just not sure how to pronounce it. But the builders' children can't easily assemble and disassemble the machine wherever um, need doth compel it. This doth prove most useful when we must needs carve out isolated sections of the caves. I did have early modern English at university, by the way. I'm not sure if I mentioned that already. And the way they use some of the early modern English stuff is a bit wrong. Most of, not often times. Um, there also was a forum entry about this once. On the three forums. That was kind of interesting. Somebody, I didn't think somebody went into more detail listing how like some of the stuff they they use is wrong and some of the stuff they use is right anyway my eyes spied another nugget of silver today the veins are rich with the builder's bounty methinks i'll keep this little discovery to mine own self okay did you and where did you hide it oh, not behind that maybe it's, it was the woman i just knocked out who, who wrote this do you have anything on your belt some kind of nugget? No. Okay. Well, I guess not. Mm. Well then. Anything here? 
pretty dark. We do have some flares though. And I never use them, so why not use them now? Okay, nothing here either. Okay, the flare disappeared. What's this? Let's use another flare. Okay, nothing. It's a long way up. Oh dear. Yep. We could use the elevator, I think. That's gonna make a lot of noise. So instead... <gasps> we'll just climb. It's not easy. Let me up the brightness a little bit. I don't think it appears on, on video if I change it. But at least for me, it should. Maybe? No, not really. Well, a little bit, I think. somebody mm, and I also hear a, a, a camera I don't like that it's probably another reason why we shouldn't use the elevator the elevator may actually pass by a camera well, there it is does it turn this way it does but it shouldn't be able to see me Gas arrow. Anything here? Not really. Might have to up the brightness later when I upload it to YouTube. <coughs> it's really quite hard to see. Even for me. Jump over here? Okay. That worked. There seems to be a guard here somewhere. A boiler, this okay. or perchance <coughs> nice gate to workshop. <coughs> and this the camera? No, <coughs> both are gates. But what I don't know which which of these options is on and which is off. I'll leave it for now. Although, no, I'll just I'll guess and either I have. Two open doors, or no open door uh, at all. If I leave one closed, I have to come back anyway. But this way, I might have to come back, or maybe not. You see? So I'm taking my chance. Too bad I can't turn off the camera. Damn, I should have checked which way it's looking. Oh, would you look at that? I think I know how to turn it off now. Quick, quick. Did you see it? Did you see what I saw? Oh, jeez. Why did that work? That's wood, isn't it? Okay, I guess I have to use a different way to do what I want to do. Careful. Maybe I can go this way. Nice, I can. And this is what I meant. There we go. What have we here? That's cool. Where does this lead? Okay, I see. Just another Art way. There. There's somebody up there. I'm pretty lucky that those vines here are not in the light. 
And I was wondering what they are doing here, but then again... Victoria mentioned that one of her spies, I think his name was Lotus, was also... Um, yeah, well... Crawling around here, spying on the mechanists, so maybe they come from him. So it, it, it does make sense if you think it, about it that way. No idea if that is the reason, but you can think of that as a good explanation. <laughs> no. What am I going to do with these? And what is that? Oh, okay, I see. This is probably one of the two gates, so I didn't Hello? get lucky. Come on. Oh, no, don't fall down and die. That would be bad. I'm not allowed to kill anyone. I don't want to. That's not the oops the way I play this. All right then. Well, I took my chances. I lost. But as I said, if I had only left one open, I would have to. Uh, I'd have to go. I would need to. You know what I mean. Had I only left well, only opened one, I would have had to go back anyway. leaving. What's this workshop? Oh dear. I thought it was just a little room, but it might actually continue. Looks like it goes, like, like it continues that way. Let's see. Scroll. Friend Goric, please make thou haste in repairing this child, that treacherous pagan, didst harm it most grievously. But fear not that any more of thy companions will be harmed, for the saboteur has been subdued. Friend Pendulous. Oh dear. Pagan that probably refers to Lotus, but if, if that's true, then that means that Lotus has been captured? Well, what do they mean? Did they kill him? Just said he has been subdued. Well, you can take that in many ways. Let's check out where this goes before I go the other way. Huh. This actually leads to some caves. That's interesting. I think we're almost at the top of the island. Oh that leads to the top of the island. Like to the to the actual island, I mean. That's probably the more sneaky way to get in. And I'm going to use that one probably, but I, I just want to have a quick look at, at this way. Yeah, that doesn't look like a good way. Lots of metal, there's a guard at the top. I'm not going to take that way. This is definitely the better sneaky, uh, th more thief-like option. Just gonna use this almost dried up well. And I almost forgot. I turned fog off for the last mission. But in this mission, we actually want to turn it on. Because this mission, as far as I remember, takes place during daylight anyway. I don't know. I'm not sure. I might... Oh, shit. I'm not sure. I, I might actually... Whoops. I might actually like it better without, without the fog. Let me have another look, as soon as I'm not so visible anymore. Okay, that's, that's okay. So, what if I turn on the fog? Oh. I'm not sure. I mean, it has... It has charm as well. <coughs> but I think I like it better this way. What's this? Oh, nothing. Can't even use it. Oh, cool. I can walk on top of this house. 
but that's very loud. And there's a machine. Let's wait till it turns around. Or let's well, move slowly. I'm gonna try and deactivate it. Shit, somebody saw me. But still. At least I managed to deactivate that machine. <coughs> oh. What's this? There's somebody there. Almost didn't see her, but... There she is. They have lots of female guards here. Not that I'm a com complaining or anything. Just. It's a nice change to most games of this style. What's this? Oh, okay. Yeah, I guess in this. Yeah, you would really need the fog. To have it look less unrealistic. But there's another guy. But I don't want it. I like it this way. Okay, let's see. I like the rain sound. That's pretty cool. I think there was a dude behind this door. What's up? What's that noise I heard? Mm. Actually, that didn't really make it. Oh, I saved it after I turned it there. I wanted to reload because extinguishing this didn't really make it. Oh, probably didn't make a difference because there's another one. Yeah, now it's better. Okay, there's another door leading to this room, and that door looks like. It's much better for looking out the sky. So I'll leave him alone for now. There's another door key here. Oh. This is a nice little house. Oh that might lead to the to the lighthouse actually. Is it connected? Yeah it is. There's the well I used. Okay, I see. The store just leads to to the area here with the house. But for now, I want to check out the house some more. this pretty dark is what it is wait oh that looks like like a door doesn't it but how do you open it Proceeding as planned, friend. Even below thy feet we extend our workings. 
the structures those pirates left behind are structurally adequate, but they show their unworthiness in the clear light of the Builder's torch. Soon, they will be replaced by iron and steel. The lighthouse seems sound enough. When once I was a hammer... The Order of the Hammer. Ha! The old ways are dead, my friend. Thou wert right to forsake the crudity of the hammer for the majesty of the gear. Aye, tis true that the old ways are crude, but they can be effective still. Look around you, friend, at these rotting planks and beaten boards. T'would take but a hammer and nail to put things right again. Again you think of the past, of repairing the unworthy wood. Tis folly. Begin anew, so that thy buildings know the glory of metal and gear. Something so corruptible deserves not the Builder's regard. Perhaps not, friend. Perhaps not. Still, it troubles my heart to look upon such disrepair. <sighs> Shit. Thief! Ah! Stop the treachery! Oh god, oh god, oh god. This is not good. Thou shalt regret so defying us! Guilty we need thy fuel! Shit. Didn't expect him to go through this door. Shadows cannot hide thy cowardice. Where is he? Where did he actually go? I mean, I'm okay with him not finding me. <coughs> shall smite oh, there he is. When I find thee. All right. That's it. Now back to explore ring. I'm still curious if there's a way to open that door. I mean, I'm sure there is, but how? That's what I want to know. Let's check. It's above this. And, uh, probably le leads to that part. Not Maybe a little entrance to some kind of cellar. No. Can I turn any of these? Sometimes these torches are actually like secret mechanisms and you can turn them and then they open something. Doesn't seem to be the case though. Maybe. Let me have another look upstairs. So there is just this chair. Nothing else. So this is a bit suspicious, but I think it's just rotting wood. Oh, what is this? Oh, it's just an opening. But maybe... Let me see if I can get up there somehow. Is that opening... Is also kind of suspicious. Um, what about. There's something, isn't there? Zoom in, please. Isn't that something? I hope this is not too boring for you, but I find this quite exciting right now. That looks promising, definitely. And how do I get in there? Hmm. <gasps> from here? I don't think my vine arrow is going to work on this. Let's give it a try. Oh. Thought so. Any 
anything here? No, it's, it's another one of those windows that can't really open for me. Interesting. Interesting. Let's see. There's another thing I found curious, and that is um, this opening here. Can I use that to jump onto that? I can. no idea if this is how I'm supposed to do this, but look where I am. Nice. What's this? My dearest Virginia, I beseech thee, my love, return not to Starlight Cove. Those notorious pirates are back, and I fear they mean to remain. Last night I overheard two of the scoundrels. I believe they're planning on establishing some kind of base in the underwater caves. I fear for my life, but the time has come to take a stand. To be safe, I have hidden our valuables in the crawl space. My only hope is that the career ship arrives on schedule so that this letter is delivered to you in time. Your beloved Nathaniel. Now, there was something about an antique navigation globe belonging to some kind of navigator, I guess, or... Um, I forgot the exact wording. Um, you know, I, you are old, You know what? I haven't done a save in a while, so I'm actually gonna save it real quick and press on restart so we can read it again. The old lighthouse keeper, okay, was quite the sailor in his day. That's probably this Nathaniel guy's guy. He was a sailor and the lighthouse keeper, and the letter we just read was written by him before the pirates took over this island. So it was actually quite the old letter. And what did that open? Oh shit, where do you come from? Oh, it opened this. Hmm. Still... That means the globe is probably here somewhere? Or is it not? Ah, wait. This, the, this thing. The, the lever I just used. Let me guess. Is it possible? Oh, I don't think it even opened this. I think this was open all the time. I was just super blind. And that's something the game does a great job. Uh, of. Is, is hiding things in plain sight, kind of, by just using textures and all that in a good way, because you don't really see this hole if you don't actively look for it. And that means, on the other hand, that actively looking for things in this game can be really rewarding. That's why I actually got into the habit at some point of always looking at the ceiling. I just need to remember doing that again. And there it is. Nice. This should fetch a nice prize. So that's one objective already ticked off. I like it. Next thing is to... Like, the other one of the additional objectives is to find the long-lost pirate treasure. I vaguely remember where that is. Like, I, I remember in what area that is, and that's not here. So we can forget about that for now. And we can now continue with the actual mission and enter the lighthouse. I didn't do that yet because I <coughs> also just vaguely, faintly remembered that the sailor's treasure was somewhere in this building. Sorry. This is what led to the lighthouse. You know what I always want to do when I see these windows? Oh, it just feels so good. <laughs> One more time. I'm um, uh, putting that aside. Let's continue. Is there anything this way? Probably just a dead end, yeah. This leads back outside where I turned off the... Oh my god, there's somebody. If someone is there, then show thyself. God, oh god, please don't come in here. 
All is quiet once more. <laughs> what is this? The wheel seems to be missing a peg. Huh. And the floor looks kind of odd. I think I can already tell where this is going. Well then, let's try to look for a peg. For that wheel. Come on. Okay. Not expecting to find it here. I'm just looking under the stairs for secrets. Kind of a creepy noise, if you ask me. What the hell is that? Storage shed key. I th suppose I can already guess what that is, like where where that is, because you remember the roof I walked upon earlier. Oh, I just pressed the. You know, um, I think I've mentioned this before. Garrett can zoom with his eye. I think I mentioned it in the bank level, and I just accidentally pressed the key for doing that. It's because his. One eye is mechanical now. Gee, I keep getting stuck in some of these narrow entrances. So I think it's this way. This shed here. It was locked. Yes, indeed. Oh. <laughs> to keep on ice. Some yummy fish here. Who's this? Oh my god. Lotus. S -s Still I breathes. Mechanist. I'm no mechanist. I'm Garrett. Garrett, yes. The lady knows me you would come. Knew I would come? But... Hush, Sneaksy friend. Time runs out. There bees a mechanist named Cavador. Karis needs him. Relies he on his craftsy works. Karis always asking. Needs he ever more and more from Cavador. The Cetus Project. Cetus Amicus. Horror of the seas. Horror of the seas. Must... tells the lady. Don't worry. I'll find Cavador. Karis will be stopped. He, you'll need... takes you the key. Beware. And... Garrett. Yes, my friend. What can I do? The cold... feels nothing now. Garrett... I begs, return me to the green. Kill me! Oh. Hmm. It's not a nice situation to be in, to be honest. But, I mean, leaving him just... You're leaving him here to, to freeze slowly. While he's actually begging to be killed. Doesn't sound like... The right thing to do either. 
It's what he wished for. It's what he begged for. So, goodbye. <laughs> it was also an interesting scene, because the usually so cold and distant Garrett actually seemed to show some compassion for him. Even calling him friend. I guess he realized the guy was close to dying and not savable anymore and kind of dropped his typical cynical cold behavior. this do? That's something we will find out next time. Hope to see you there. Goodbye.